So here we are. Welcome to Shirt Lake, uh, around the town of Cascade. Today I brought my mom and my fiance Mike. on their first backpacking trip together. So that's fun. <laughs> Sarah and I have actually done this before. Uh, this is in this basin. There's actually three lakes down here. There's Lost, Hidden, and Shirt. Lost and Hidden on, on the other side of the ridge. And actually this one, Shirt, is the most hidden. It's kind of, you gotta take this like goat path to, uh, to find it. We stayed at uh, Lost last time and we were like, you know what? That Shirt Lake would have been the coolest place to stay. So we decided to come out this time and actually stay here. And yeah, my mom was in town, so. It's a real, real easy hike. I mean, the toughest part is this real steep down into this lake. It's gonna be real tough in the morning, but yeah, we got here early, so now we have the whole day to just relax. And I like those kind of trips, okay? You don't always have to be slinging a pack way far, way far into the mountains to get away from things. Sometimes it's nice to just take a slightly heavier pack with some extra food and stuff and just have a nice overnight trip. So that's that's what this trip is. By the way, I got this new little jet boil, which is supposed to be smaller and more compact. But like, I remember having this problem before when I ordered one of these mini ones. They make the coffee filter the same standard size and then it, It like hits you in the nose when you're trying to drink coffee. I don't, come on. It's a Johnson and Johnson company. You think they could figure that out and manufacture uh, more coffee filters or better coffee presses. Sarah and I brought our fishing poles. I haven't seen a damn fish in here, but the water's warm. So makes it a good swimming hole. <laughs> I guess I'll, I'll take that, but it would have been nice if there's some fish in here. We'll see if they come out later, but uh, I doubt it. <laughs> I have a bug here. That's a mosquito bug. Okay. So far we've had the lake all to ourselves. <laughs> I mean, you hear a lot nowadays how the outdoors are crowded, which, I mean, shouldn't it? It's not a bad thing. I, people should be outside, isn't it? It's good that we're getting outside. Um, and yeah, there's more people out here, but there's a lot of out here. You know, we're less than two hours from Boise in the middle of summer vacation season with a two mile hike and we have this pristine lake all to ourselves. So if you really wanna be out here without seeing anyone, trust me, you can be. Or you could be like my mom 
who <laughs> loves seeing people on the trail because she thinks each one is a potential new friend. <laughs> and that works too. All right, it's a late morning. We slept in. I mean, we got nothing to do today. Two miles to hike out. An arduous two miles uphill to hike out, so we're probably procrastinating. But we have nowhere to be, so we can take our time. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.